guys, it's Professor Prime here with MyJapanet.com and today we are taking a look at Vibration Stars Uzumaki Naruto. I picked this up at Ross. If you did not see my Ross toy hunt video, it should be up now before this video actually goes live. So check it out and I talk about how I found the figure and my thoughts on getting the figure if you're interested to know all that. But today we're actually going to look at the figure. So we're going to go into detail of the figure. So first, let's take a look at the packaging. I really like the artwork. The artwork is really, really good actually. Actually, it's Vibration Stars. I think it's how I pronounce. Yeah, Vibration Stars. Yeah, and there's the side of the box. Looks really good. And then we've got this really stuff. I'm always going to keep the box. And I'm going to do a video showing you guys how to remove these labels off the box. If you're, especially if you're keeping the box or if you're storing the box to resell or anything like that. I'll show you guys how to remove these without damaging the package or anything like that. And then right here, we've got Rock Lee and we've got Naruto. Doesn't really say how tall they are. So let's go ahead and let's uh, get her out of the box. I wanted to show you guys how it comes. It's actually quite large. So we've got a display stand. We've got the back of his uh, ninja uh, band. We got the bottom half and the top half. That is usually how these things come. So let's go ahead. I'm going to get her out of the box. All right. So we got it out of the package. Now we're going to go ahead and I'm going to show you guys how to put it together and let you guys know there's no instruction. We don't need instructions because these are pretty self-explanatory. Now the base, the base is my, made in China. It's pretty, pretty bland. There's no, there's no logo like Naruto logo or anything like that. But before we do anything, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take this little headpan piece and I believe it goes on it's right there it's right if you guys can see that it's right push it in so that's the main thing is I'm really afraid of and, and the thing is like this is very oh there we go it's in and then it's kind of just it's gonna plug itself in there oh it's tight it is not coming done and then we take the first peg and then the second, it should just line straight up. There we go. Maybe, maybe I got it backwards. Maybe it should go the other way. Let me try putting it the other way. All right. No, nope. seems like that foot connection is, Ooh, nope. I think that was the direction it goes. It's got to go that direction. All right, guys. So this figure, yeah, I'm impressed with it. I, I love it. Let's go ahead and let's, let's get in on that face skull. He's got that like, Oh, I'm coming like, ha, you know, ha, you know, it's pretty, it's super cool. I love the detail. I mean, it's pretty accurate to the show. And of course, if those wondering, there's no articulation statue but i'm sure an sh figure art of this character particular version would be awesome as well and then of course it said it's it's orange plastic basically it's orange translucent plastic i'm pretty sure those are like probably stickers for the eyes or, or it might be painted too and then we've got it's really hard to see on camera but he's got the it's it's detailed in here molded in here the uh, headbands uh plates and then you know he's got it, it's gonna be a great figure when i put it on the shelf yeah so final thoughts uh the stand doesn't plug in very good it's one of those figures statues that obviously you're not gonna move around a lot but if you do have to move it do grab it from the base because if you grab it by the figure it see right there it just popped out can be fixed with you could put some like putty putty on there to, to increase the peg hole you cannot flip it i've already tried <laughs> yeah guys so yeah i love this figure it's it's a really cool figure guys overall i'm gonna give this a five out of five it's a pretty good figure yes that is a very that is annoying but it's awesome also a statue and once you put it on the shelf it's gonna stay like that and it wobbles a little bit but i mean it's it's pretty sturdy so i mean it's not gonna fall off the shelf or anything like that so i'm not too worried about that guys but yeah guys i love this figure it's gonna be it's the first naruto figure for my collection i'm super excited i i'm planning on doing more statues and anime statues like that for the channel before i forget there he is with hot rod thank you guys so much for watching today's video if you enjoyed watching this video Check out this video right up here in the corner. And as always, guys, until next time.